Right then, we're ready to head up uh, back to Burton and we're going to join defender Dan Happy live in the dugout. Dan, for, uh, first of all, congratulations on the clean sheet. Another point, it's three draws in a row now. It was uh, a run-of-the-mill game today, though. Can you hear me, first of all? Uh, you can, yeah? Yep, uh, Yeah, three draws in a row. Um, obviously, defensively, it's been good. Kept, kept a clean sheet, but uh, we're better than that, you know. Uh, we thought we could get three points today. We thought we'd get three points Tuesday. There's something definitely to build on as with the clean sheet, but uh, yeah, as I said, it's got to be better. And you've, we've switched recently to the back three or, or, or maybe a five if you count the wing backs and you're playing in the middle of that. Um, how are you finding that role and that system for you? Yeah, it's nice. Everyone wants to play uh, middle of the back three, don't they? No one wants to be outside the back three. Um, I'm enjoying it at the minute, um, but we're, ve we're very versatile. As you can see, the last 10 minutes went to a back four as well, so uh, we could do whatever. But yeah, it's been good. It's been decent. And we had a few chances to win it today. Uh, there, there was a couple of chances and some really good saves from Crocom in, in goal for Burton. Uh, it, it just felt like it wasn't going to drop for us at, at times today, though. Yeah, I, I disagree, really. I think we should have opened up a Open them up a little bit better, you know. We had a lot of shots from outside the box when really we should carve them open. Flash boss, uh, flash balls across the box. That is, we're taking pop shots on 25, 30 yards. So uh, we're we're better than that. So as I said, we should be, we should be winning this game two three nil if we if we do the the, the final pass and execute it properly. And a massive blow in the first half with Jordan Graham uh, going down with what looked like a, a knee injury. It's a, a big blow to lose a, a player who's such a influential attacking outlet in, in the team, even when he's playing from, from wing back. Yeah, definitely. You know, he brings so much quality um, when he's on the pitch, the balls he provides. Um, he's got a lot of assists for us at the minute, so um, he's going to be a big miss and uh, we're all sending him our love. Daniel, um, uh, it's, it's been an, a really interesting week because Tuesday night felt like you know that, that last minute equaliser was, was a, a great moment and then Today felt like just a fairly a stodgy affair, um, but two away games where you're getting two draws. What's the mood like in the dressing room? It's not great, if I'm being honest. Uh, as I said uh, previously, we feel like we should be coming away with these with three points. But the mood, the mood Tuesday was obviously good, last minute uh, equaliser. And then you come here today and you expect to get three points, really. So uh, the boys are a bit down, but all we can do is move on onto Saturday FA Cup, try and get a good cup run. We'll just go from there. And looking to that, it's a slightly different test, but obviously we know uh, what Carlisle have to offer beating them just a couple of weeks ago. Uh, probably a, ch a chance for Richie to maybe give some other players some chances as well, but it's a different competition and a, a different kind of a different challenge. Uh, yeah, def definitely. Um, it's going to be a dogfight. We played them, as you said, a couple of weeks ago and it was a dogfight. Uh, might get some fresh players on to get freshen up a bit, um, so, uh, see what we can do. But well, we're going to go into that, trying to get a good cup run. And uh, as I said, we'll just go from there. Just finally, a thousand fans for Leighton Orient's first ever game at Burton. They've been in immense voice recently. There's been a lot of away games, the drums banging loud and clear. Um, we're feeling it from here in the studio. It must be fantastic to have their backing from the stands. No, they've been different class, uh, especially away from home. Uh, they're bringing the numbers in and they're really helping us out. So uh, well done to them. Well, Dan, thank you so much for joining us. We're going to let you go in uh, safe travels home and send Jordan all of our love as well. Have a fantastic evening. Nice one, boys. Have a good See weekend. See you later.